Watch this beautiful trading day of mine. Hi traders, first trade today PDD. Now take a look at PDD started with a gap down today and tried to move higher and failed. And uh, as it starts to reverse here, I'm about to short it, getting ready right now and clicking the button and moving into a short position with 4,000 shares. Again, take a look at the topping tails, take a look at the reversal candles. Um, the stock did continue kind of moving sideways for a while. I did expect it to come down faster after I did admit that. But you know, uh, when the stock is weak, starts weak and gapping down you would expect a gap and go and that's what uh, really is about to happen take a look at what's happening now just breaking down under the lows I'm up uh, three grand four grand uh, five grand first sign of a pullback I'm going to click the button and I'm going to cover 3600 shares right now so just uh, took my partial covered 3600 shares left 400 shares often I'm being asked why am I leaving uh, these 400 shares or whatever part of my initial trade well traders you know when I put the risk behind me when I get to the point where I'm making money and there's no way that I'm going to get red in PDD anymore then a small size to continue uh, without any risk that is something that I can do now I, I've got my profit cushion and I just let it ride and as you will see later it did continue moving and if you are enjoying this video so far don't forget to give us a thumb up that will help our channel it's right here that button beneath our video and uh, you know the more we are the more YouTube sees uh, thumbs up it helps our channel so if more people like you would like to learn more about day trading we would really appreciate if you give us a thumb up helps us helps them helps you let's continue with the rest of my trades today my second trade is BTBT if you uh, noticed uh, recently I've been trading quite a lot uh, BTBT because it's very extended on the daily and I am expecting it to come down strong and now it's reversing with a gap gap down I'm expecting gap, a gap and go and clicking the button here and I'm short 4,000 shares now again the same idea nothing's uh, changed uh, though stock started with a gap down try to move higher failed and now just touching the lows and probably will continue so that's pretty straightforward gap and go and in fact it's proving to me now that it wants to come down so I'm about to add some more well it's actually just moved to a new low and I'm clicking the button here now for another 4,000 shares why because it's trending lower and it's proving to me that it wants to come down in fact at that time the market started moving up a little bit but BTBT kept to the lows you can see that it responded to the market by moving slightly higher here but look at the way it comes down again and I am in fact uh, about to add some more so I'm planning to add another 4,000 shares because it's proving to me that I'm right and then again you never add to a losing trade but now it's coming down and I'm clicking the button right here right now and I'm adding another 4,000 shares the stock is proving to me it wants to continue look at this beautiful breakdown just moved under the whole number and um, uh, just continues and again a pullback here a pullback there but the, the trend is very very clear the stock is very extended on the on the daily so it looks like it wants to come down and look at this beautiful new low right now and it just reached my target and I'm about to take my partial actually made a small mistake here by taking a smaller than expected partial and right now clicking the button and taking my partial that was a beautiful trade in BTBT and again you add to a winning uh, trade you do not never add to a losing trade you never average down your loss but if a stock is going your way and it's proving to you that it wants to continue you can definitely add the biggest winners my biggest winners are the ones that I'm trusting proving to me that I'm right and um, therefore I add and here's another trade FCEL trying to move higher again a gap and go and I'm about to short shorting here 4,000 shares now the same idea does that get uh, are you getting bored seeing the same kind of trades all the time <laughs> well if you notice there's a lot of different variations between each and every one of them I mean where they started how they moved how far did they move up how far did they come down where did I move in to short the stock and so on just notice that look at the breakdown which is just about to happen right now here we go look at this lovely breakdown I'm about to take my partial 3600 shares right now 
And again, leaving another 400 shares for a bigger move. And the market did continue to come down. So I did get a much bigger move in everything I traded today. But again, the risk is behind me. No worries. FCL is doing the job. And I just continue looking for great trades. Next trade, plug. This one's different, right? Well, only because I missed it when it first moved down. Anyway, I'm about to short it because it's proving to me that it continues the trend and I'm clicking the button here and I'm short 4,000 shares. It's just a very nice continuation. And again, a very fast forward now so that uh, you can see what happened. The stock looks to me like it's holding to the lows and it looks to me like it's about to continue the downtrend. And in fact, I did miss it. Look at what happened right over there. I should have shorted it, but you know, you just can't take them all because uh, you know, they all trigger the same time approximately. So right now, breaking down to an new low I'm up uh, almost three grand right now getting ready to take my partial clicking the button here taking my partial so that was a continuation trade that was not the trades I showed you earlier where I took them at the beginning of the trading session you know you just have a limit to how many trades you can follow at the same time but uh, it worked out fine and um, a few more thousand dollars to my account Last trade for today, Boeing, I'm about to short right now 4,000 shares, clicking the button right here. Now, Boeing is different. Why? Because it's kind of going sideways. It's not weak. As you can see, it's really, it, initially it moved down, but then it moved higher. Why did I think that Boeing is going to come down? Well, there's two reasons for that. The S&P just broke down under the lows and the airlines just broke down under the lows. So I thought Boeing should join them and uh, it just happened. I'm getting ready for my partial here. And again, that was a fast forward, I took my partial here and uh, a few more thousand dollars. You know, stocks don't uh, move by themselves. They move according to the S&P 500, that's 60% of the movement of the stocks that you're trading. And approximately 30% of the movement of the stocks that you're trading comes from the sector. Now, if you watch the airlines, the airlines broke down and Boeing was expected to join them. Now, you've got both, both things working for you. The S&P is coming down and breaking under the lows, and the airlines are coming down and breaking strong under the lows. Well, Boeing kind of have no chance to hang on without coming down. So I thought Boeing should join them, and it did. And again, it's a percentage game here. You, you look at Boeing, it does not trend lower. It really is just going sideways, but you short it because the sector's coming down, that's a 30%. The S&P is coming down, that's a 60%. And sometimes the stock has a life of its own, that's the 10%. And here are the results for just 37 minutes of trading. I closed trades with uh, almost $11,000 and I'm still riding the rest because the market keeps moving lower and there's no reason for me not to keep riding them and the market continues to move my way. And if you're watching this video and wondering if you can make money too, just take a look at the numbers here. I just asked my trading room members to let me know how much money are they making today. On the left side, our trading room members. On the right side, our free YouTube channel. So take a look at the numbers here. Well, some of them are losing money, but most of them, as you can see here, are gaining. Well, it's not an easy game. Trading isn't easy. Trading is a very hard occupation. But you know, most of our traders are with us for a long, long time. And just take a look at the numbers here. You see that the vast majority of them are making money today. Some of them are losing money, but uh, we're very proud that what we're doing, we're trading all together. And you're very welcome to join us because you know, you do have a link right here below, which uh, you can use in order to sign up for a free 14 day trial to our trading room. And again, uh, if you want to see more of these uh, day trading videos, just make sure you subscribe and turn the notification bell on. You've got the button right here below. And if you do like to trade with us and uh, join us in the trading room, Again, you'll find some links right there below. So we'll be very happy to trade with you. And uh, don't forget to give us the thumb up. Uh, and uh, that helps our channel, helps you too. The more we are, the better we trade together. So thank you very much for, for watching this and just have a great weekend and I'll see you all next week.